What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we are back in Scrap Mechanic. That's fantastic. I got my little uh, beam gun right here. I got my little attacher, you know what I'm saying? And we just got some work done. You know what I mean, bro? You know what I mean? Uh, I want to thank everyone for all the love, the support, and the comments and the wonderful interactivity I'm having with all of my new subscribers. Thank you and welcome. Make sure if you are coming across this channel for the first time, leave a like and subscribe for more daily gaming videos. Fantastic. Enough of the talking and like the promotion and stuff like that. Like the things you gotta do when you have a channel, you know what I mean? You know what I mean, bro? Diesel, what you making? What are you making, you silly goose? I made a hot air balloon. Now, uh, it kinda looks like a light bulb. Uh, and I get it. I get it. But if I add any more to the top, then I gotta add more rockets and then it, it's just gonna be humongous. And then when it, the bigger a machine gets, especially when you're talking about an air, well, an air machine, you know those air machines? Uh, the flying machines, um, it can get a little funky the bigger that they get. And then you gotta try and do some science. And you know me in science by uh, checking out that Walker episode. <laughs> still for you. still working on it. <clears throat> oh, I just I didn't realize I missed something here. I just realized I missed something here, yo. What you missed, Diesel? Mm, let me tell you. Let's see here. Dude. Oh, is that good? Oh, that goes straight down. Okay, cool. It must be symmetrical. It must be pretty because all of the weight on the inside is evenly distributed. Hold on a second. Smile. I think I'll, have to, I think I'll take a selfie. I think I'll take a selfie. Uh, let's see. All right. So there are ten rockets that fire us up into the air. There are four rockets right here, or thrusters, if you will. Uh, four thrusters to turn us while we are in midair. Uh, there are five buttons. Really, only six are in use because balance and weight. And I just wanted to. I was even thinking about possibly moving them, but this is. Uh, even, so there's six buttons there, you know, it's got to be even, it's got to be even Stevens, but then when you go into three, and then three, that makes it odd, and it makes it sad, so sad, let's see what we got here, boom, alright, so, button one goes up, and the uh, button one lifts us off, then we have, on the inside, there are four thrusters on this side, to propel us forward, if we have a, if we need so, you know, and then we have propellers, uh, propellers, thrusters in the back to generate us back. Now, this is actually something. These thrusters are basically a balancing thing. Like, uh, it doesn't. Move, I mean, it'll move you forward, but it'll tip you over. So you kind of gotta like nudge it a little bit. You just gotta like a little tap, 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 tap. I don't want to do that. Listen, in my day, I would have killed for tap, tap, tap. Um, I think this is actually a pretty cool thing that you can do and add to your builds as well. The uh, wires, let's see here, the wires concave bend. These little bad boys right here make anything. I just noticed that. I'm like, ah, oh, you could do, you could make some really cool designs, like circular designs. I don't think, uh, I mean, we could maybe even think like a drive shaft or maybe an engine. Yeah, right, right, right. Uh -huh. The wheels are spinning. The wheels, they are spinning. Yes. So. Ideas, and I want to thank everyone for all of the comments and uh, and lovely contributors uh, to some ideas. Uh, there are things in the works, and once I get to working on those, you shall see the creations we can create. Yes. So, like I said, this is basically all hollow, and the best part about thrusters is you don't have to have them exposed to the world. You can you can actually put a block right up against the end of a thruster. And it'll still work. It'll still work in its exact uh, meant. That's uh, how it's meant to. How it's meant to act. You know what I mean? And uh, so you can put thrusters right up against each other, and it will work. It will be fantastic. Let's just move you there. Like I said, there's just wood, wood, and a, and a aluminum ducks. Ducks quack quack. Duck duck goose. Duck duck goose. So like I said, two thrusters up here two thrusters down there and they are matching and mimicking on this side five buttons connects all of the things for us today now what do you say we light this sucker off anybody have any champagne do we, any, any champagne any fine champagne that we can christen this thing with ah hold on I don't but I do have a hammer 
I anoint thee the USS Blimp of Fancy. Good day, sir. Sir, I said good day. All right, so what do you say? Now, like I said, uh, I didn't even say it. Uh, just a chair. Just a chair can connect everything up. You don't uh, need a driver's chair unless you have an engine. <laughs> From what I understand. Or steering? If you want steering? I think you do have an engine. If you want an engine and you just want to sit in it and have it drive you. Yeah, you can totally do this. I'll see why not. That's my choice. All right. Let's get ready to blast off in three, two... One, boom. Ever so slowly, it will lift us up into the air with the greatest of ease. Well, Diesel, that doesn't really fly all that fast. Oh, yeah, because when you get into a hot air balloon, it just shoots you up into the air. Wrong. Wrong. No, it does not. Now, uh, the button, I believe, is two actually propels us forward, so I've got it kind of backwards. But this is pretty nifty how it just goes up. Uh, <laughs> hey, Diesel, your, uh, your little dwarf dude... Um, he's getting tan, he's getting a sunburn, baby. It's like, it's a little hot in here. It's a little hot. Which I never understood in a hot air balloon. I'm like, okay, so you're shooting this hot, hot fire, like, right above you? That seems like it's dangerous. And they're like, it is dangerous, because you're going in the air in a hot air balloon. I'm like, oh, yeah, good point. So then when we can want to spin around, we can do it like this. Now, it does kind of tip us a little bit forward. So then we balance ourselves backwards now in scrap mechanic once you get to a certain elevation it thinks that you're going into like supersonic mode and then we'll blast you up into the air <laughs> as, as brutally fast as possible so let's see here if we can spin you around spin you spin you this way we can get a beautiful a beautiful picturesque landscape of our whole area here we can do that quick get everyone everyone get your camera out Everyone get your camera out for pictures, pictures of our lovely land here. Now, I think that in the, when the survival mode comes out eventually, I'm not really sure when it's going to come out, but if it does, uh, that'd be awesome, because I can't wait. Um, I think this could actually be something that you could use in like a base. I really do. I really, I really, 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 really do. Um... So you can kind of get a lay of the land, you can kind of get a scope on things, and see where people are at, see where the, uh, the robots, see where they're at. Um, now the only thing about, uh, that's bad about this is that there's no aerodynamic physics, so it doesn't, like, even out when you're in the air. It's just gonna thrust ya. We're gonna thrust ya. But look at how pretty this is, baby. Look at how pretty you is. Oh, you are so fancy, you are so pretty, so nice, yes. Oh, you're so lovely. Flying through the air. Kind of leaning forward a little bit, aren't we? Whoa, whoa. Well, isn't this dandy? Let's get a little picture. Why not? Everyone, grab your cameras. Yay! Taking a little picture. Why, hello there. Hey there, big guy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. See, now we get to the certain elevation, and now we start going a little bit faster. It's a little faster. More pictures. Very cool. And, oh god, we're out of control. It's getting a little nutty. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. It's going supersonic mode. It's going to ludicrous speed. Oh, watch out for the tree. Oh. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. Okay. Get me out of. Get me out of this crazy thing, Jane. Uh, let's see here. All right. Now where are we? I need a scout. I need a scout to come and scout me out. Ah, there we are. So, kind of cool. I know that it kind of looks like a light bulb. Um, but like I said, once you start adding some more things on the top, then you have to add more 
for potion, and then it gets a little bit wonky when it gets toward to like a, a bigger thing that you're gonna try and float into the air. But I think it does pretty good for what it is. Kind of looks like a face. It's got a nose, smiley face, like a Simpsons character. Not really. Like a rook on a chessboard. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Yeah, all right. So, folks, if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead, hit like, it helps my channel out ever so much more than you know. And if you enjoyed it so much, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos are coming out every single day, every single week, folks. Have a great day, afternoon, evening, good night. Peace out, like, shout, y'all, and I will check you out right here again in Scrap Mechanic next time. All right, let's see if this will take us forever to do. I think it will. I think it will. So pretty. So nice. So calming. A little hot, a little warm. It's a little warm. I'm not gonna lie. A little warm. <laughs>